Hey gang, it's JJ. You might be wondering what I'm doing while I'm swinging my arms this way. Well, I'm walking. I have uh, been walking on this little under desk treadmill for the last couple of months now. And uh, I've been meaning to do a little video to kind of promote this idea. Um, like a lot of people, I spend hours and hours a day, hours and hours a week on the computer because I do a lot of virtual personal training sessions. So I have had a standing desk for a very long time. And over months and years, I started to notice it was harder for me to remain as lean as I like to remain because I'm not burning a lot of calories like I used to be when I was running through Equinox in the Bay Club, just standing here. Um, also, I started to notice some pain returning to an old injury in my back. And I just thought, JJ, you're not dumb. You know what the problem is. You know, standing is better than sitting, but standing isn't moving. So I started to research, I'm super cheap. I was starting to research treadmills to see if it would even be feasible, if I could even possibly do my job safely for myself and safely for my clients and be moving like this and still be doing virtual sessions. But I'm also cheap uh, and I thought it wouldn't work, honestly. So I found the cheapest treadmill I could find. It was 170 some dollars and it came in a big ass box and I put it where it is now and I have been pleasantly surprised with the results. So I can hop off this thing and type if I need to, or I can take a step back and demonstrate an exercise if I need to for a client. And then I can very easily, without even taking my eyes off the screen for more than a second, hop back on. Uh, I keep it at a very slow pace. Uh, I do this, if I have four to six virtual sessions a day, so I'll do it for four to six hours a day, just kind of slowly meandering. Again, I can always pop off if I need to. Um, I have noticed that uh, using my Whoop wearable, I now burn 1,500 to 2,000 more calories a day. Walking is good if you're trying to create a caloric deficit. Um, the other thing I was not expecting to happen is that my back pain that had inched back up to like a four or five out of 10 most days has now gone down to a one. So I have significantly less joint pain as a result of just loosely, Okay, I'm not gonna try to be seductive here. But, uh, so, if you are looking for ways to increase your movement and you can at all figure it out in the culture of your work to be able to do this, this is what most of my clients see. I just introduced it, I didn't even announce it. And no one really noticed that I was doing it. A couple of clients, when I asked, I would say, hey, do you know that I'm on a treadmill? And they said, I can see you're swinging your arms, but I didn't think much about it. Now I know I'm a trainer and I get to live in this world, this context of movement and none of my clients are gonna complain. And I've been told by some of my clients that they want a desk like this, but they would be laughed out of, out of their office you know, if they were on a meeting with their boss or with a new client and they were doing this. So I'm not a moron, I understand. I wish life wasn't that way. I do challenge you. Are there some internal meetings that you could do this on? Can you announce it to your internal team or maybe to your direct reports and say, hey, I'm trying to get in a walking practice but you know, I'm really busy. Do you mind if I walk on my treadmill as we talk? As you can see, you can still type, you can still make eye contact, you can still pay attention. So anyways, uh, if you are curious, I don't like work for the company that makes treadmills. This is literally just something I did and it really, really helped me get, uh, get a level of fitness, both physique fitness, both some of my aesthetic goals, as well as my mobility uh, goals of just being pain-free. So this is a long one, but uh, if you need help figuring out how to fit this into your lifestyle, feel free to message me and uh, walk. It's awesome.